Okay, 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 there it is. Look what you started, Danielle. I was like, girl, you putting on. And then I started to cry myself. Um, good evening. There are so many people I have to thank for this evening. They played a pivotal role in my journey and without their presence, their wisdom, their encouragement, <laughs> their honest perspective and their love. I know I couldn't stand here before you all today. I often hear people say that it takes a village to raise a child. And I know that God purposely put, well, placed me here in villages, so to speak, during my time here at Texas A&M. My villages came in all sizes with people of different races, from different cities, cultures, um, and experiences. And yet my villages had all these commonalities that molded my actions, my goals, and my life. So I just wanna take a moment to talk about my villages. Um, they valued honesty and truth. They made love a priority. Sacrifice and selflessness characterize who they are. Their bravery in facing issues and continuing on despite adversity really helped me to see the value and the strength that I possess as a human being and the importance of togetherness. And in my failures, they taught me how to get up and try again and that I could have a different result simply with enough faith, hard work, courage, and the right effort. My villages never, never let me give up when the going got tough. So I thank them for walking in their purpose. And in doing so with passion, it inspired me during my journey here at Texas A&M to seek and achieve greatness in every area of my life. I can confidently say I have been successful and I have this moment tonight because of who they are as individuals and as a collective group. And because of them, I have and I will continue to aspire to great heights. To the villages that helped pave my foundation, figuratively walked with me here at Texas A&M, <laughs> I love you for being there with me every step of the way, for going before me, and just allow me the freedom to make my own decisions, whether they were right or wrong. You all reinforced that my value wasn't based on anything tangible or anything I won or lost. The fact that I'm God's creation and just my very existence, that is where my true value lies. And to those here tonight, to those at Great Limbs away, and to those watching above over me, I thank you. You set the bar of excellence. You showed me how my character would take me further than any prize or award and that it needed to be authentic. You showed me that leadership wasn't just about what I do, but how I do it. I was shown that loyalty isn't just about standing by an idea or a belief or a person just because it's familiar. It's about staying dedicated to the truth and being honest and loving to those we care about. And lastly, you've all shown that doing for those who cannot do a thing for us really show what's in our hearts and reflects who we call master. I serve a great God and I just know that he put me in these villages over 2,000 miles away from Cleveland, Ohio and I just feel like I had, I had family. And because he knew the hearts and the impacts of the people here, he purposely planted me here. And so your examples, your love, and everything that you just contributed, contributed, ooh, that was hard, to me, it's truly unforgettable. And I just thank you all. Thank you for everyone who, who voted. Um, it's truly a blessing just to stand here before you all today and um, to be inducted into the Hall of Fame. So thank you.